in this question we are asked to draw the development of a square prism whose vertical faces are equally inclined to vp now this square prism is also having a horizontal hole which is drilled through the geometrical center of the prism with axis perpendicular to vp so what we are having is we are having a square prism and in which we are dr drilling a hole so we have to draw the development of the remaining portion in the question you are asked to place the vertical faces equally inclined to vp so that means one base edge of the square prism should be placed at an angle 45 degree so in order to satisfy that from xy line first you start with a, a 45 degree line and on this 45 degree line you can draw the top view of our square prism which will be a, a perfect square once you have drawn the top view you can name the corners a1 b2 c3 d4 after completing the top view project all the points towards front view and then complete the front view so this will be our front view you have to check the visibility and then identify the corners the height of the prism is given it is 60 mm now next we are going to draw the development of this square prism now development of any prism whatever be the prism it will be a rectangle now here since it is a square prism we will be getting four different rectangles each of width is 40 mm the reason for the 40 mm is the length of the base edge is 40 mm so the width of each rectangular face also should be 40 mm so for drawing the development first you start with a rectangle of width 40 mm and height 60 mm you can name the edges as a1 and b2 this will be the first rectangular face of our square prism now since it is a square prism four similar rectangles has to be drawn so at the end we'll be getting our development like this this will be the first rectangular face this will be the second rectangular face this is the third one and this is our fourth rectangular face if it was a pentagonal prism we would be getting five rectangular faces okay so we have drawn the top view the front view and the development of our square prism now in the question you are asked to drill a horizontal square hole sorry a circular hole of 40 mm diameter so first find the center of the square prism and with this point as center and a 40, the 20 mm radius you draw a circle we will be drawing a circle you can name the generators as p dash q dash r dash s dash etc so we have drawn the circle exactly at the center of front view and then we will be naming the generators now in order to get these points in development project all these points horizontally towards development i will be projecting all these points towards development and you need not now mark any points in the next step what you do is project all these points vertically project all these points vertically towards top view okay so when you are projecting these points towards top view you will be getting p on two edges q and w on two edges similarly v and r will be lying exactly at the corners similarly here you will be getting the generators s and u and on this edge you will be getting t so i will be projecting all the generators in front view i will be projecting it towards top view and i will be identifying the points in top view next what you do is you transfer these distances towards development that means the distance from b to p the distance from b to p should be marked in development from b here so we'll be getting point p here you have to mark it from p that itself will be the exact same distance from b to t also so when you are marking b to p you can mark b to t also since they are same same distance can be marked from d also d to t and d to p also will be identical so with a single point this distance this distance this distance and this distance all this will be identical so when you are marking a single point you can transfer it four times you can mark it p here you can mark a t here you can mark again t here you can mark p here similarly transfer the points q w and s u also q w and s u you transfer it towards development you will be getting q w here 
s u here similarly s u here and q w here so from the top view points we will be transferring all the points towards development now from these points you draw vertical lines okay now when you are drawing the vertical lines it will meet the horizontal lines at specific points p and p from the develop the from the vertical line and p dash from the horizontal will meet at this point similarly q and w will meet at these two points r and v will meet at these points similarly s and u will meet at this point and t will be meeting at this point same thing will happen here also okay now when you are joining it you will be getting a perfect ellipse you are expected to get a perfect ellipse and you have to darken the area that is getting retained that is getting retained in top view as well i mean front view as well as in development so try to draw the figure